All right, good morning guys. Welcome back to another episode and another adventure. Hope you're all doing well. I'm in Ontario and as you know, the restrictions have loosened up. It's the first weekend of overnight camping. I'm at Silver Lake near Perth, Ontario, about an hour and 20 minutes from Ottawa. I've got Angela and the boys with me. We're having fun. There are no plans this weekend. We're just doing our thing. I'm taking you with me. But man, it is nice out. I'm getting in the water. And we'll just see how she goes. So let's go for a swim. Check this out, got some new boardies. Check that out, loving them. All right, we're gonna have a fun weekend. I'm gonna take you along after, show you a little bit of the campground, what it's got to offer. There's a beautiful day use area. So if you live in Ottawa or you're in the Perth area, it's so close to get here. Have a look. The campground is coming to life. You can see everybody's out. The water's beautiful, so that's our weekend. No plans, we're just having fun and we're going with it. All right, let's carry on. Aww. This is for you. Service with a smile. <laughs> <That's it. laughs> Okay, the boys headed way out. There's an island way out there. So the boys went out for a paddle to go check out the island. Oh geez, I just got surprised. <laughs> oh my God, you just made me poop my pants. <laughs> you're, you're, you're on camera. Okay, well, there we go. <laughs> oh, nice one. She got me. We got all our stuff set up. We got a bunch of chairs. There's my little beach reclining chair with a little umbrella. Got some music playing. Chilling out. I'm gonna grab a seat for a second and uh, then have a little bit of a snack. Just enjoy the water, enjoy the day. I could almost fish right from here. Well, too many kids in the way, but. There's the boys, wrapping it out on the lake. <laughs> Adventure Chris TV, trying a pivot turn. Okay, good morning everyone. I'm not going to be too loud because it's still really early. Most of the campground is, well, you can hear some people starting to get together. I'm going to head down to the beach while it's really quiet. I want to show you right now. Um, this is our camp. Pretty typical setup. You know, we've got our tent. Tent. We've got a kayak over there. The eating tent. Chairs. Fire pit. We had a beautiful steak dinner last night. You know, clothesline, all the towels and gear. More paddle boards, everything else. 
but that's not what I wanted to show you is and I'm gonna be quiet because most people are still either asleep or they're just starting to come to life look at this this is a this is the hill that we've been up and down about 25 times yesterday right down to the water here yeah, I'm feeling it today it's not too bad but especially when you're carrying gear and all that stuff up and down and up and down the hill but definitely got my leg workout yesterday before it fills up I just wanted to show you so this is like a little bit of a day use area. You can move these tables around wherever you want. Now, what I wanna to mention too is that right now for the provincial parks in Ontario, the day use, the day use area is free, but you have to book in, a, in advance. So you have to book a spot to reserve it. It was full yesterday, full. And, uh, but if it's during the week and you have the day off, especially at this place, because it's only just over an hour outside of Ottawa and, uh, you want to come just for the day, do a little cook up, swim, paddle, fish, wh whatever it is you want to do. And you just want to get away. Things are opening now, finally. So I recommend coming here. It's a really nice spot. And you got some fire pits. Somebody's already out fishing over there. 7.30 in the morning. I was up earlier, but I needed my caffeine before filming. All of this area. Oh, there's two kids right there. They were in the water for 10 hours yesterday. These two little, there's my neighbors. My neighbors, my camping neighbors. I was talking with the fella, his kids. They live in the water. There are a couple of little fish. So here's the the main the main beach and that tractor just came along cleaned this whole beach up so that's nice that's where all the rentals are there's a boat launch over here as well they're getting ready to launch their boat um, so if you come for the day use you could bring your uh, if you have a fishing boat motorboat you can launch it here and then uh, there's a spot to park Look at that, nobody's been here yet. So it's sort of like getting fresh tracks when you're skiing. Kick my sandals off and just walk on this nice soft sandy beach area. What a gorgeous morning. I didn't even do any fishing this weekend, which is okay. I've been doing a lot of fishing lately. And like I said, this is more or less a uh, a weekend getaway. It wasn't a planned adventure. I'm here to spend time with Angela, the boys. It's uphill both ways, just like going to school. All right, I'm gonna show you. So. Came up the road, still have to walk up. That's our site up there. And then uh, the boys are staying in uh, my truck tent. You would have seen that in my my uh, tent video that I was showing different types of tents. I'll just show you, they're still sleeping. They were up late last night. So if you guys remember this, my truck tent. But it's, uh, yeah, just more of uh, promoting this particular campground. I've been coming here for, year, for years, even, even when I was a toddler, when I was a youngster, I'd come here with my family. So, great spot. I should get in touch with uh, <laughs> the province of Ontario for <laughs> Parks Canada. Maybe I can do promos for them. All right, I'm gonna wrap this one up. Not an adventure, like I said. This is more just the first weekend getting out after the restrictions lightened up. We got out to a provincial campground, showed you a little bit of where we were staying. Good food, cooked on the fire pit, the swimming, the snorkeling. So hopefully you enjoyed that. A few clips, just kind of uh, what, our what our relaxing weekend was like. And hope you're all having a great weekend. And like I said before, 
keep checking online because some of the campsites might come available. That way you can get out and do your thing. All right, as always, I'll see you in the next. Cheers. Somebody just sneezed. Let me start that one over again. I'll go, that'll go in the blooper roll. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, okay. <laughs> now there's a car coming. Okay, you guys are you guys aren't helping me. What are you doing? I'm the one that does the <laughs> editing. So I decide what goes in and out of Adventure Chris TV as the producer, executive producer of my show. All right, thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. As always, I'll see you in the next. Cheers.